A big red barn marks the entrance of the LSU Ag Center's Red River Research Station. Ripe red tomatoes lure visitors into the station located on 500 acres in Bossier City. The station isn't defined by only those two symbols, however. Research is varied and projects are numerous. Greenhouse tomato research is an important and unique project at the station. Dr. H.Y. Hanna is one of the world's leading greenhouse tomato researchers. He grows vine-ripened, high-quality tomatoes using little or no pesticides. Fertilizers are used, but the runoff in this setting doesn't make it to the ground. We developed a, an economical, uh, cost-effective technique to uh, uh, recycle it safely and uh, reuse it over and over again. Scientists at the station also work with row crops grown in the northwest region of the state. Research focuses on plant breeding, insect and disease management, and evaluations of varieties released from private seed companies. When you get a new variety out, nobody knows anything about it. This is unbiased data that growers can use to help select varieties. A constructed wetland on the station allows researchers to look at pesticide and fertilizer runoff from fields and evaluate the effectiveness of natural, biological, and chemical processes of reducing water pollution. The station also maintains a herd of beef cattle that allows researchers to work on pasture management systems. At the Red River Research Station, scientists conduct a wide range of projects that benefit farmers, cattle producers, consumers, and the environment.